top two ways to reduce the stress of moving. All right, number one is going to seem super obvious, but it's not always obvious to people, but hire movers. Some people try and go the DIY route or they rent a U-Haul truck or whatever the case may be, but hiring good movers is definitely a great way to go. You're going to pay a little bit of a premium, obviously, but I included a picture here of my favorite local mover, Super Movers in Hampton, New Jersey. Um, they do a fantastic job. They're very careful with your belongings and their services can range from actually packing up your boxes to having you pack and then take the boxes to the new location. Um, highly recommend this route. I know that all my clients that have used Super Movers in particular have absolutely loved it and had no regrets about paying them a little bit extra money to go ahead and move for them. And option number two, this may be a little less obvious, but Pods or Pack Rat, the brand will depend on where you're located, which one's closer to you. But these are the things that you see sitting in driveways. The nice thing about this is that they can come drop it off and you have like 10 days to slowly, gradually pack the thing. So what, what I did when I moved out of my house was I just every night I put a little bit more into the pod and then close it up. They pick it up out of your driveway, they drop it off at the new house and you're done. Another good way to combine these two things is to Pack all your small items, the things that you're per personally going to pack into boxes, put them in the pod, get that pod out of there, and then have the movers come and get the big furniture. Easy way to reduce the stress of moving, and uh, I stand by both these companies. They were, they were great with me personally and are always great with my clients. Follow for more real estate tips.